Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Tanika and today I thought we could do another online browse with me at Kmart. My pregnant ass is getting way too big to be walking around the shops. So online is where it's at. There have been so many more new releases at Kmart. I only did one of these videos two months ago, but there has been like another huge drop. Lots of really nice women's clothing. So let's start browsing, get into it. I'm excited. All right, let's start with women's latest arrivals. Now, as I said, I am pregnant, which is probably a good thing because otherwise I would go ahead and buy so many of these clothes. Like just from what I've seen on Instagram, like amazing. Like cargo pants. Cargo pants used to be like loser pants when I was a kid. Like, oh my God, she's wearing cargo pants. I was wearing cargo pants, so it's okay. I'm a loser, I could say that. But they're back. And the way I've seen them styled, they look so freaking good. We've got three different shades here and they're only $25. Lots of these midi length ribbed skirts, they are so up my alley. This probably even work while I'm pregnant. Oh, like look at that beige color. Oof, I love it. And that chocolate brown. Oh yeah, they are nice. Okay, these are front split pants. I saw, her name's what Maria wears. She does the most beautiful outfit posts. And she did a look recently with a bunch of Kmart items. I'll, I'll link the reel in the description box because the outfit was amazing. And this style of pant just looks fabulous. These crossover wrap jumpers are very on trend. I've seen them a lot in like boutique stores and I love that we're getting that nice brown color. Lots of different shackets here, some nice checkered ones, a denim one, and I know that there is a white one as well. Okay, these puffers, love. I bought a like corduroy, <laughs> corduroy puffer from Kmart last year and it was Fantastic. Like I got so much wear out of it. I'm very tempted to get this pink one. Like doesn't it just look fabulous? If you're more into the vests, they've got a few of those as well. I am loving this purple color. And then there's also a white. So much cute active wear as well. Like look at these hot pink shorts and they've got a scrunch bum. Very trendy. I don't know if they're really for me but love the color and I love that they've got the long version as well. Okay, this is a bit hard to see and looks quite boring considering it's all black, but this material has been super on trend lately. Oh, let's see if we can get, yeah, that close up there, you can kind of see it better. And I love how you've got the matching top and bottom. Like if you go onto any boutique website at the moment, you will see an outfit like this. Oh, this knit dress, beautiful. And again, in that nice brown color, also comes in black. I really, really like that. That might even be like a good breastfeeding option. Okay, these carpenter jeans. When I see these, it just screams to me, my little sister would look so freaking good in these. I don't know about me because I am like 31, <laughs> but how cute are they? Like so stylish and I love the wash as well. Not really vibing with these cardigans. The prints are a bit too much for me, especially that black and white one. Okay, these long sleeve tie front tops. Again, this is what I picture my little sister in and she's 20, so she is just beautiful and cool. Those carpenter jeans with one of these tops, stunning. My boobs need way too much support. I could not wear that top, but I do love it. I do love it and it comes in black as well. My nips would be literally showing in the middle there. <laughs> We've got these coated leggings for $25. Very Sandra D, aren't they? Got some more knit dresses. These ones don't have buttons. The material actually looks all right as well. Some of the knit material that Kmart has, like when we get into winter and they bring out their jumpers, it's like, it just looks scratchy. But this, because it's like that ribbed knit, mm, it looks good. And I always find with like the ribbed knit stuff from Kmart, I usually size down because it does have quite a lot of stretch. Boxy sweatshirt. <laughs> this is more, this is more me right now. Oh, that comfy loungewear. Yes, that looks good. Okay, again, these little crop tops, they're just so cute. Just so stylish for Kmart. Got some cute flannel pajamas for winter. There's the matching track pants to 
that sweatshirt. Those carpenter jeans also come in white and this nice green. Oh my God, that was only the first page. <laughs> okay, I really want to get my hands on this blazer. It's the Relaxed Boyfriend Blazer. I love that kind of oversized fit with the blazer and the shade is just stunning. Active Women's Kick Flare Leggings. Yes. Don't they look cute? Look at that waistband. It's a little bit hard to see because it's black. But in this picture, you can kind of see that it goes down in that V. I like these basic long sleeve tops that they've got. Again, the brown, mm, beautiful. Just really nice for layering, especially as it gets into the cooler months. Okay, I actually need to get some new no-show socks because my feet have grown a whole nother size since becoming pregnant. Like, what the hell? Are they gonna go back down? We've got these faux leather skirts, one in black, one in a chocolate brown. I did buy a faux leather skirt last year. Like, it was one of those pieces I really wanted in my wardrobe. Uh, wardrobe? Wardrobe. I was like on the hunt for a good one. But I don't know, just my body shape, I couldn't find one that fit me nicely around the waist, but wasn't like really baggy and gross as it come down because my butt is big. So maybe I'll have to try one of these on and see how it fits. Like $20, that's a pretty good bargain. Here we go, we've got some nice chunky knits ready for winter. Loving the brown, the blue's nice as well. We've got white and green. They look really cozy, don't they? Corduroy pants. Ooh, coming soon, $30. What have we got? Black, stone, and green. <gasps> oh, oh, I love the stone wash ones. These corduroy shirts, I have bought a few in the past as well, and they're really nice just for layering, chucking over the top of like jeans and a t-shirt, exactly how they're modeled here. Another relaxed boyfriend blazer in this checkered pattern. Oh. <laughs> You're coming home with me. And matching pants, come on. Like, come on. Some of the Everlast branded active wear they have at Kmart is actually really cute. Like this pink set is nice, but the Everlast brand and logo just kind of screams a bit um, Darrow <laughs> to me. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, I just, I don't know. Like that is so cute, but Mm. Alright, let's have a look at some of the latest shoe arrivals, starting with these chunky loafers. Now, these aren't really my style, but I can appreciate how cute they are. And they give me such 90s vibes, don't you reckon? Are these something that you would wear? Let me know. Okay, the boots. Kmart is killing it with the boots this year. Croc detail flared block heel boots. $30. Are they not just beautiful? The croc pattern, the chunky heel. Oh my God. Okay, it's not coming up in latest arrivals, but I know there are more boots because I bought a pair and we've got to talk about it. Okay, it's these ones here, the gusset high heel boots. Again, $30, similar to the croc ones, but they've got that elastic panel. We've got brown, black, and this beautiful cream pair. I picked up the cream pair because I've been after a pair of cream boots in my collection for a long time. And this style is just mm, right up my alley. And then if you do like more chunky boots, like Doc Martin style, they've got these and also in the bone color. Beautiful. Again, they're not really my style. I don't know if I would wear them, but I can appreciate them. All right, let's look at the latest arrivals accessories. All right, starting with some scarves. Again, the fabric of these scarves just mm, not for me. They remind me of felt and they just look ugh, cheap. Okay, I am obsessed with this fedora hat. The shades look, oh. Okay, I've got a hat similar to that color, so I don't need it. I don't need it, but I want it. Sometimes the fedora hats that came out look a bit cheap too, again, because it's like that felt material, but the little band around it, like the braid, just gives it that bit of extra zhuzh, doesn't it? Right, these bags I have been seeing styled all over Instagram. They are super cute, just little crossbody bags. I love the shades. Kmart is killing it with their color choices. Okay, I bought this bag a few weeks ago, the soft corduroy tote bag. 
It is fantastic. Really big. It's got a little inside zip. You've got the pocket on the front there. Lots more scarves and gloves getting ready for winter. Ooh, this structured tote bag is cute and in that croc pattern. Okay, these bags here. Obsessed. The croc pattern, it just speaks to me. Oh my god, look at it. It's so cute. I love that thicker strap that it has. I would like all three of them, please. So let's go into the beauty section, shall we? Lots of skincare that they have released, like retinol, vitamin C, niacinamides, and I'm just not sure about the quality. Like these are, you know, strong ingredients. Well, this is only 1% retinol, but like, do I trust Kmart? I don't know. And I don't really know enough about ingredients to be like, that's safe to put on my face. If you do, please leave a comment down below because like they have a lot of really affordable skincare. All right, the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer has landed at Kmart. They do also have the green one. I've seen it in store. It is $24, which I think is pretty pricey for e.l.f. I'm sure you've all seen that the e.l.f. Halo Glow has finally dropped in Australia. I do think it's exclusive to Priceline though, but it retails for $35. So I don't know what's happening there with Elf, but I feel like they're starting to get a little bit pricey. Okay, I saw these the other day. They are the Whip It Up shower foams. So a dupe for the Sunday body shower foams that are available at Priceline. All right, we've got a dewy serum primer, a brow soap. I have a feeling Katie from Katie's Cosmopolitan has tested out that brow. So if I'm remembering correctly, I will link a video in the description box. I've also noticed they have released so many perfumes, like dupe perfumes. So this one here looks like a dupe for, is it like the Marc Jacobs like Daisy range? Again, I don't know a lot about perfumes to know like how good they are, but like $12? I love the look of this makeup organizer. First of all, the purple, stunning. And the way that it folds out like that and then closes back up, <sighs> very nice. This makeup brush holder bag looks super handy and it's only $6 if you travel a lot. With OXX Cosmetics, they released like this new range with this bluey, purpley background, like packaging. So I don't know what the difference is between this packaging and like the black packaging, but this is a liquid blush. That's speaking to me. So yeah, see, we've got another one. This is a highlighter stick. Oh, I picked up this recently, actually, the BYS Brow Glue to see how it compares to the NYX Brow Glue. We've got some new lip kits available. Like, look at that packaging. It's just so nice. Those shades look good too. So we've got a lip liner, bullet lipstick, and a liquid lipstick. Okay, we've got to talk about this. Their new 4D brush range. How beautiful is this packaging? So aesthetic, like seriously. I know that they do have some individually, so we need to get to those. A new powder blush, and look, this perfume set here. Ariana Grande, hello. Ooh, they released an eyeliner stamp pen. Elf has dropped the Luminous Putty Blush. I'm not sure if they've got the Luminous Putty Bronzer yet but I have seen this in store already and I did pick up one to try. Okay, so here are some of the eye brushes. I think they're the same from the big pack, but we've got like an angled one. These two don't look extremely fluffy, but they might even be good for liquid products like spot concealing or something. They've dropped lots of the four pack of the liquid lipsticks, like the little mini ones, like the Huda Beauty ones. I have tried them. The formula is nice, but the shades were just like, really different to how they look. I know it was weird. It was a while ago though, so maybe I should pick up a new packet to try. All right, so they have the Maybelline Vinyl Ink Liquid Lipstick online, which I'm actually wearing today in this shade Cheeky, and it's only $22 at Kmart. It is 20, I think 26 or 27 at Priceline. But this lipstick is freaking amazing. It is 
so long lasting and for a liquid lipstick it's extremely comfortable i do have a what's it called instagram reel where i show you the lipstick throughout the entire day of me eating and drinking i'll link it in the description box pretty impressive facial ice contour roller i've been seeing these all over tiktok i don't really get it like you just rub ice on your face is that what the deal is all right well i think i might wrap it up there that was really exciting looking at all those new releases i definitely want to place a little online order if you enjoyed watching please give this video a thumbs up as it really supports my channel i will link my last online shop with me at kmart down below as well as all the other videos and people that i mentioned well i hope you're all having a great day you can come and follow me over on instagram and tiktok and i hope to see you all in the next one bye